First of all, Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Good afternoon. So today I'm going to present my contribution and the title is New Evolutionary Algorithm for Multi-Objective Spur Gear Design Optimization. The work is presented by Dr. Hamoudi Abdelazak, Senior Searcher at Mechanics Research Center of Constantin. So the outline of my talk is given as following. Firstly, we will talk about background and motivation of this research. Then we will present the proposed algorithm which is named as Modified Adaptative Max Differential Evolution Algorithm. Then we will present the optimization problem of cylindrical gear design. In the second part, we will discuss the results of the algorithm for this problem. And finally, we will conclude the presentation by some conclusions and the possible future works, inshallah. This work is in the context of mechanical design optimization. As we know, Gear is the most important component used to transmit motion and the power between rotating shafts. It is widely used in mechanical devices and machines such as automobile gear boxes, wind turbines, airplanes, marine vessels, and a huge industrial power transmission. Among the different existing tip, gears, cylindrical gears, are the most tip used in the mechanical machinery because they are the simplest, represents more than 80% of the total gear production. Economically, they are the lightest expensive to manufacture. In addition, this kind of gear is characterized with high operating performances. For many reasons, the gear design is a complicated task. There are many objectives which are often conflicting with each other. Gear design involves many empirical formulas, different graphs, charts and tables. Also, the Complex shape and the geometry of gear leads to a large number of mixed design parameters and the highly nonlinear function. For this reason, this research presents a new evolutionary algorithm for multi objective optimal tooth profile of pure gear design. Also, the proposed method aims to treat the mixed variables and to avoid the manual choice of control parameters setting, also to speed up the convergence behavior of the standard version of differential evolution. The follow chart of the proposed method is given in the following figure. In the first step, the control parameters of the algorithm must be specified, including the values of the population phase, the maximum generation, and the dimension of the, of the problem optimized. Like other evolutionary algorithms, our developed method starts the optimization process by randomly creating a set of initial candidate solution, of course, within the feasible limit space of each variables. After the initialization step, the fitness of each initial solution is evaluated and the penalty method is proposed to deal with the constraints design. To avoid the manual choice of mutation factors and the crossover factor, the self-adaptative approach is used. During the selection step, the feasible 
point approach is employed instead the conventional selection. When comparing between two solutions in the fusible region, the one with a better fitness value is selected. The procedure mutation steps, crossover, and selection is repeated until satisfaction criterion is satisfied. As a case study, a cylindrical spur gear in large transport machine is taken. The problem is formulated for two objectives regarding the maximum bending stress and the specific sliding coefficients. The bending stresses is modeled explicitly using finite element analysis. In addition, several constraints are considered. The optimization problem is developed for three mixed variables, two continuous and one discrete. Also to solve, to solve the problem, the weighted sum method is used. The results of the optimization are presented in a table one. It can clearly seen that the optimization results found in this research led to perfect balancing in both of bending stresses and the specific sliding. The, st the statistical results of the used method are presented in a table two from the small value of standard deviation, it is clear that our method is very robust. In the second part, the optimum design variables obtained by our algorithm are used to prepare a CAD model, then the stress analysis using finite element method is performed by using ANSYS APDL in order to check the results found in the previous section and it is clear from the both values of bending stresses that there, are, there is a perfect balancing between the two values. Finally, we conclude this presentation. The results show show that the ability of proposed method to optimize the complex problems, also a significant improvement in balancing specific sliding coefficients and the maximum bending stresses were found. The obtained results give a base for developing complicated mathematical models for the maximum stress that taking into account all other involved aspects for solving the optimal tooth profile of cylindrical pure and helical gears. And thank you very much for your attention.